Hello, my name is Nicholas Cohen. I'm a physician, and I'm here to share with you a top 10 list of tips of insulin management for type 1 diabetes. Tip number one, my recommendation is an insulin pump. A continuous insulin pump provides the best and easiest and most effective control of insulin in type 1 diabetes. My, all, my, my second best option, or the number one alternative, is multiple daily insulin injections. Tip number three. If you decide to go with multiple daily insulin injections, or there are reasons for you not wanting an insulin pump, such as the cost or inconvenience of having to wear the pump, then I recommend the multi, multiple daily in, insulin injections, giving yourself my specific recommendations for insulin are Lispro, a shot before breakfast, which is a fast-acting insulin, and a, a shot of Glargine, which is a long-acting insulin, that too before breakfast. Before lunch, I recommend a shot of Lispro, and before dinner, I recommend a shot of Lispro. Tip number four, the dose of Glargine. The dose of Glargine should start at 0.15 units per kilogram. So you take your body weight in kilograms and multiply it by 0.15. Of course, you're doing this with the help of your doctor. But this would mean for a 70 kilogram individual, which is an average sized person, 10 units of Glargine before breakfast. Tip number five, the dose of Lispro is I recommend starting at 0 0.05 units per kilogram before each meal. This would be for a 70 kilogram person, three units of Lispro before each meal. The dose should be given about 15 minutes before you actually eat. Tip number six. I recommend checking your glucose before each meal, as well as before bedtime. So before breakfast, before lunch, before dinner, and then before you go to sleep. Tip number seven, I recommend eating consistent carbohydrates at each meal. This means that before breakfast, or your breakfast, your lunch, and your dinner each have a, um, from day to day, have about the same number of carbohydrates. The easiest way to think of this is that the three types of carbohydrates are breads and starches, milk, and fruits. So. For breakfast, if you usually have a bowl of cereal and, a, and fruit, then you're having one serving of cereal or starch and one serving of fruit. So each time you have breakfast, you should plan on having about two servings of carbohydrates. Then keep a log of your glucose levels. So I recommend keeping a log of your glucose levels. This is tip number eight as well as a log of your carbohydrates. Let's say do this for um, three days. So you're, you're writing down your, gluc your glucose that you check before each meal and before bedtime. Then you're writing down the number of carbohydrates you ate. So if you had two servings of carbohydrates for breakfast, two for lunch, and three for dinner, you'd write for each meal the number, that number. So then you bring your log in to a doctor or um, a nurse practitioner or your dietitian, And this is a great way to be able to adjust the amount of Lispro, which is the short acting insulin, as well as the amount of Glargine, the long acting insulin that you're getting. And tip number 10 is to believe in yourself. There are more and more options for effectively managing type one diabetes and managing type 1 diabetes effectively prevents almost all the complications that come with type 1 diabetes. I hope these tips are helpful and thank you very much for listening. Have a great day.